You're listening to the AfterBuzz TV Network. Now the largest new media platform on the web and your number one source for after-show entertainment. Very good, Gene. Johnson. After Buzz TV. The AfterBuzz Studios in Los Angeles, California. Presented by Maria Menounos and streaming live thanks to Akamai Technologies. This is AfterBuzz TV's Defiance After Show. We'll break down tonight's episode and get you all the latest news and gossip. And now, another post-game wrap-up show for your favorite TV show. It's AfterBuzz TV's Defiance After Show. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, my. I try. I try not to be an indigent, indigent spy <laughs> on this episode of television. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, folks. Welcome back to the Defiance After Show, season two, episode nine. A very special episode of Defiance. Yeah. Very yeah. special yeah. episode of Defiance, <laughs> painted from memory. Brought to you by Blossom. Brought to you by Blossom. <laughs> I'm Matt Lieberman. Uh, joining me as always, the panel's all here. Jesse Klein, the bad boy of indie comedy, is here. Hey, everyone. How's it going? <laughs> uh, Scott Morris here. Hey, guys. Nanda Velasquez here. I try. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you Lord do. Knows you I try. try. No, yeah. you do try. You do, though. I try. You do. Yeah, thank you for yes. trying. Yes. Uh, That's all you can do. Yeah, so, uh, folks, a fun episode this week. Uh, yeah, we had Kenya's return. She she appeared out of Kenya's. nowhere. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Kenya, Kenya. Yeah. in quotations. Yeah. Uh, quotenia. Like the country. Yes. Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. no, what? Berlin what? like the city. Oh, Berlin yes. like the city. city. I thought you meant, like, like in country. quotes, like the country. <laughs> like the like, country of Kenya does not exist. The country of Kenya does not exist. It's, it's, it's not in this voice. No, it's it's not, not, not true. Not, li- not in this world. Isn't that right. interesting? Yes, the country does not exist, and neither does she. Yeah. 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 Here we go. There we go. Everything that's Kenya We should have known going. right then. Yes. I mean, we, we kind of guessed it last we week. Yeah. We did. That there's no yeah. way that she could possibly be alive, uh, and that she might have been another Indigene spy, like our astronaut from last season. Mm-hmm. But we didn't know the whys. We did not know the wherefores. Nope. Uh, and we got to see it all play out for us this week. We finally got to understand what Pottinger's evil evil little scheme was <laughs> and uh, we found out just how lame it was yes it was so yeah. disappointing it was really lame it was disappointing uh, after all that I know uh, we're, you know I'm like I'm tempted can we just can we just jump right in with Pottinger yeah. real I mean, quick can yeah, I just sure. say he, he's yeah. He's kind of, I mean, I don't go that way, but he's kind of a good-looking guy, right? Yeah, yes. objectively a very objectively good-looking, good-looking guy. Yes. So, good-looking. so really, why does he have to create such a crazy, <laughs> so desperate, desperate story <laughs> I know. to get a girl? Can we, can it's we, not like it's not like he can't just walk up to someone and say hi. Well, there yeah. was so much work. Yeah, so much, so much work, work to get somebody <laughs> behind this. Pottinger in middle school, Jesse would have come up with the exact same plans on how to <laughs> <Yeah>. get girls. <laughs> But like, okay, well, the CIA will come in, and then I'll save the girl. Yes, like, perfect. Like, and then she'll love me forever, yeah, ever and ever and ever. And then you know, I'll like get to when touch her, her sister, boobs. right? Mm. And then when her sister dies three months later, I mean, she'll just get over it, and she'll be with me. Yeah, she'll, she'll come just, to my arms, and and I'll, I'll, I'll touch her, her feel boobs. better. I'll touch yeah, her boobs exactly. all the time. Yeah. Mm. Um. Yeah. It's, Unlimited it's, access. I, I hate him. I, I hate do. him as a villain and mm-hmm. as a man because he's just like. He's, he's his so plans are so lame, and he's a terrible shot, mm-hmm. and he, like, everything is so small-minded. Mm. I feel like we came up with so many more theories <laughs> for why he was using the ego that were far more devious. Yes, I thought yeah. there was so much like, more to this than that, and right, that was no, it? Yeah, no, he secretly, he wants to be with her because <sighs> he's in love with Connor because of all the... No, no, he just likes a girl and is too much of a ponce to do anything mm. normal about it. Here's what I'll do. I'll get her hooked on drugs, see? Then, <laughs> after she's hooked on drugs, I'll resurrect her dead sister, who I know where she's buried somehow. Or not. I don't I don't. I don't know have to she, know I don't where have she's to. buried. I don't. I'll just make yeah. a copy. And then I'll use this doctor, who will just do what I tell her to do. Otherwise, I'll send her back to prison. And mm-hmm. then I'll just use that. And then the sisters will come back. I'll have, I'll have rescued her. Mm. And and then, mm. then, she'll, then she'll maybe go to prom with me. <laughs> like Pretty a, much. Yeah. Tune in on a special episode yes. of Defiance. Uh, Go to the Defiance Prom. Yeah. 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 Under the sea dance. Ooh, Defiance Prom. <laughs> yeah. no. oh, Nando, we all know there are no C's left. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. No, there, there are. There's beachfront property in Angel Ark. Angel Ark has beachfront yes. property right. Right. in the valley. Yes. In yeah. Hollywood. I mean, yeah. Is there such thing as a sea of bodies? I feel like that I probably think that's is. I think that's possible. Yeah. All right. So, going back to the top of the episode. 
Uh, Kenya makes a triumphant return to the need want. Um, and uh, or what, what was the very opening scene of the episode? Was it uh, was it uh, it was Stama at the need want? Uh, no, it was. Uh, it was Nolan kind of being a dick. Yeah, they were to trying Kenya. to get Kenya to remember. Oh, yeah. Trying to get her, her memories. memories. Yeah, mm -hmm. and, like and really just hounding her. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, it seems all too convenient that she's there. He's doing yeah. his job. Yeah. Um, a little aggressive though. But it? it's almost like, hey, seems... man, don't you remember? You kind of almost had a relationship with this woman. You yeah. gave her a flower. Also. And she didn't want you to pay her anymore for the sex. Also, she's the sister of a girl you've also, also kind of been, been with. seeing. Mm -hmm. And Nolan is just everywhere yes, with this pants yeah, off, man. dance off, man. Mm. You know, he's mm. he's he's all up in Tommy's grill, uh, <laughs> and all up in Tommy's girl, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. and in Tommy's girl's grill. Yeah, Tommy. both. Yeah, both yeah. Rosewater <laughs> sisters. Uh, Bear Grylls is grill. Uh, oh, Bear right, Grylls is grill. <laughs> but girls is grill. Yeah. yeah. He hasn't, he hasn't hooked up with girl. Stama yet. He hasn't hooked up no, with Stama but, yet. Hey, but I think it's that's, a matter of time. It's exactly. Matter of time. Yeah. 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 Well, this show knows what it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Everyone <laughs> will sleep with everyone that's right. who is named Nolan. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. To get what they need oh, want. It totally is high school. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretty much. It is. And that's oh, why Pottinger is, is so mean. Because <laughs> um, Nolan's so popular. He sleeps with everyone. I mean, yeah, he has a lot to offer because he, like, saves people's lives and is kind of honorable and really cool. He's competent. <laughs> yeah. Um, so the, he's hounding her, and she can't quite remember. In her mind, all she remembers is being captured by Goggle Boy by uh, mm -hmm. Brian Goggleman, mm -hmm. as, as, uh, as we call him here on yeah. the panel. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, <laughs> you and, can call him that. Yeah, she remembers yeah. only the last th few weeks of mm -hmm. her life. She yeah. remembers uh, uh, being captured. She remembers him interrogating her about her life in town. And then he remembers be uh, she remembers being rescued. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's not, not good enough to mm -hmm. know it. She's been alive for over a year, or she's been missing for over a year. What's the deal? Yeah. And she only has weeks of memory of her capture. Right. Yeah. Very suspicious. Mm -hmm. Very suspicious. Suspicious. So uh, they go to the need want where Stama is, uh, is like, throwing shade at Treasure Doll, her mm. future <laughs> daughter-in-law, mm -hmm. uh, pretty much, <laughs> after she totally breaks up the marriage of mm -hmm. Christy and Alac, mm -hmm. uh, and is uh, stunned to see Kenya Rosewater return oh, from the grave oh, yeah. to the wonderful ethereal sounds of this amazing cover <laughs> of, uh, of What's Up by the Four Non-Blondes, Blondes, mm. yeah. uh, which I love that they carried through the title I did. sequence. They did. And it was Kenya's kind of theme. It was yeah. when she came back show, in, it was her yeah. little intro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I loved it. Yeah, she, it was, she had literally seen a ghost. She yeah. freaked out and... Well, yeah. no, no spit, because like, yeah. hey man, she looks her right in the eye, and yeah. Kenya just smiles yeah. at her, yeah. and she has no idea whether or not Kenya, yeah. whether she's seeing a ghost, or if yeah. Kenya knows, Kenya's got to know that she poisoned her, and yeah. she's come back to kill her, and you know, everything is, uh, all of this stuff is, is based around the fact that I'm a poisoner, I gotta undo this. Yeah, Stama had a really interesting arc this entire episode. Because she still got a lot of conflicted feelings. She, she didn't want to mm -hmm. kill Kenya. Yeah, mm -hmm. she was still completely in love with Kenya mm -hmm. and seeing her. And Daytac yeah. pretty much said, "I didn't, I didn't expect you to kill her. I'm okay with that." Yeah, yeah. And, and she and she had this amazing breakdown. She was like, "Don't tell me I killed her for nothing." Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he's like, "You didn't kill her, but yeah. uh, enough digging of those flowers, you mm -hmm. yeah. found a human yeah. skull." Oh my God! And like, I love the moment when he actually, when he just says, you know, you didn't have to kill her, or like, I didn't need you to kill her. She was just kind of taken aback, like she had never realized that that was an option. Yeah, yeah. He's like, you just, need, I just needed her under control. Yeah, I was and like, I couldn't really? even do that. Yeah. You, yeah, you obviously didn't kill her. You sent her away to some namby pamby camp. You thought you never, she'd never come back. Well, now she's back. So thanks a lot for nothing. Mm -hmm. That's my day tech. No, that's a good day tech. That's really it's, good. Uh, exactly. Thank you. If that's I closed my eyes, I thought it was him. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So we'll we'll get more into that scene in a in a minute. Uh, so uh, Kenya's back, and uh, we're starting uh, very slowly but surely to notice a pattern with her memories. She and Amanda are bonding together, and she's got all these great memories of her and Amanda. And yeah. Uh, we even get a scene ten years ago uh, about their their first moments in defiance mm -hmm, together, mm -hmm. which like I'm almost kind of puzzled as to why we got that scene because I thought okay we're gonna get a series of flashbacks that's yeah. gonna explain yeah. something, yeah. Mm -hmm. but we only got the one scene. Yeah. What's up with that? Uh, I think I think it was kind of to show the pain 
that uh, that the indigene that is playing Kenya goes through when she realizes that she is not Kenya. Got it. That it is to show mm. like how these sisters used to interact and how much they loved each other mm-hmm. and how much they saw defiance as a new opportunity for them. Right. A rebirth. And, a rebirth. And, and, yeah. a, and a rebirth. And so it's to see how that indigene uh, had had to experience all of that love and thinking that she was a part of it and then to realize that that wasn't actually her. And that she wasn't a part of it. But yeah. I, I also took it as something for us, too, to kind of see as well, like that moment when they first got there, because we haven't really seen that yeah. before. So it was us to kind of get, like, you know, Manda and their first moments literally and off the like bus. And it's like, we're not going to have, we're not going to have Kenya for long. We have yeah, her for this episode. Exactly. Let's mm-hmm. do what moments we can, mm-hmm. what we can fit in. Yeah. I get that. Yeah. But it was odd that it was just that one it would, it would be kind of cool that. to see everyone's first time in Defiance. Mm-hmm. Like if every episode we got a, a first time in well, Defiance. Well, we already know. Well, do we already know Nolan and Rafe's first Rafe. time yeah. in Defiance? The show, yeah. From the yeah. Beginning. So it would be what mm-hmm. Rafe and Daytac, yeah. I guess. Yeah, and, and uh, you could do. Yeah, you could do them. You could do uh, Tommy. Mm-hmm. No, that's I true. mean, we saw yeah. young Tommy with uh, with Kenya's ex husband, and oh, when he right. turned yeah. his life around. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, oh, that's right. And got mm-hmm. made a deputy. Yeah. In any case, um, Treasure Doll. What's, yeah. what's her story? Yeah, no, what's yeah. Treasure Doll's backstory? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm very curious. <laughs> I would want to know. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, uh, and we can also learn about her first time in Defiance. Mm-hmm. Uh, 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 terrible. <laughs> uh, so, you know, Amanda's obviously thrilled to have her sister back. Wait, she's had a first time. <laughs> yeah. Okay. The, there has to be every a first. Time. Every I mean, time. We did see, and, and and the pun also works with what Jesse said. We also right. saw Nolan and Arissa's first times in Defiance. Mm-hmm. That's true. That's true. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, no. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, so Amanda's obviously thrilled to have her sister back, and uh, so Ken- happy. Yeah, and Kenya's like, thank you for taking care of everything while I've been gone. I don't remember why I left. I'm so happy to be back though. Let's run the need want together. Amanda's like, oh, no, 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 no. We're not doing that. Uh, And Kenya kind of plants this seed of like, no, you want to be mayor again. You Mm want to be mayor. Uh, And Amanda's like, I'm I'm working on it. Keep it hush, (laughs) hush. This is kind of happening. Uh, and, uh, you know, they're kind of conspiring, like sisters. Sister, sisters yeah. conspire. That's what they do right. when they're happy, right? Yeah. That's, sisters. All, that's all sisters do is they just right. talk and talk like, and conspire. Talk and gossip and conspire. Sisters. Yeah, conspire. like good sisters. They conspire <laughs> yeah. and talk They and inspire and then and they conspire. Several times. Only date single child and children, guys. Yeah. Only, only date a single child. Oh, buddy. Oh. You have a story you want to share? No, no I'm oh. just saying the, the sisters aren't worth it. They're just... They'll just talk bad about you behind your back. Well, and what 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 is it? I it's so I so I ate with my hands. What I'm a monster now? Uh, is that your pottinger? <laughs> that's my pottinger. Oh, I know what I'll do. I'll resurrect your dead dog and I'll bring it back and then it comes back wrong. Speaking of Jewish accents, <laughs> um, we what we know more more fun <laughs> Jewish stuff this week. Oh, good Hala that. has become sugar bread. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Sugar Hala bread is French canon. toast. Yeah. yeah. Um, and there was something else too. I don't oh, know. Well, it was the uh, them talking about uh, uh, World War Two. Oh yeah, with Berlin. The, with oh yeah, Lenny Riefenstahl. And Lenny yeah. Riefenstahl. Berlin is yeah. called Berlin mm-hmm. because she's been called a propagandist. propagandist. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Also, Berlin down for a three-way. Just needs mm-hmm. to know someone's name. Right. Yeah. yeah. And well, I'm not necessarily... That makes sense. You just, just want to at least know their name so you know what the... Sh- but not like... Just needs them Wait, to is know that their a, name. Is that another World War II Jewish reference? Or <laughs> no! Down for three ways? Yes. Yes. Down for three of course! Ways. Not a World War yes, of course, course it is. Did you sure. learn your history <laughs> yeah. in class, I in school? I never went to school. Okay. Never. <laughs> they uh, taught that. No, well, uh, to me, I read it almost as like, you know, like, well, I'm sleeping with Nolan, so... Uh, I guess I gotta be open right. to stuff. <laughs> Hi. Exactly. Oh, like I think it's more a statement on her low opinion of him than anything else. Oh, I thought she was down for it. I thought I think she was like, my name's Berlin, but yeah. it, it, let's just do this. I mean, this is a new world, you know. Like when Kenya was when Kenya was like, we're gonna find new husbands, and Amanda's yeah. like, I don't need a man to you know be have a good life. She's like, fine, a new wife. She's like, oh, I'm not getting a wife. Stop. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> it, yeah. Stop. Yeah. Um, You're okay. all I need, Kenya. Yeah. Just sisters. So uh, 
Before we move on, I just want uh, to take a quick second to talk about something from our, our good friends at Walmart who sponsor this show. Folks, I know you love to save. Yeah. Who doesn't? You're, you don't want to run all over town uh, clipping coupons and driving everywhere just to find the best deal possible. You mm, want to know that not. when mm -hmm. you go to a store like Walmart, you're going to get the best possible products for the best possible price. There's no question there. But here's the thing. Sometimes these other companies... They try to step to Walmart. They say, hey, Walmart, we're going to beat your price. We're going to lower it even so low that we're not even making a profit just to get people in the door. Uh -huh. Crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Meanwhile, Walmart now has this new service known as the Savings Catcher. So that when, you know, you need savings and they're falling from the sky, you don't have to run around to catch them. Walmart's going to catch them for you. So any other place, if you buy something at Walmart and you find uh, it advertised for a lower price anywhere else, you can go to walmart.com slash savings catcher, enter your receipt, and you will get an automatic e-gift card for the balance, the difference between what you paid at Walmart and the lower price somewhere else for absolutely free, instantaneously. It's a crazy, awesome, awesome bit of savings. It's really, really cool that they're doing this. It's super simple. It's super easy. Become a savings catcher to get today. Go to walmart.com slash savings catcher and start saving with savings catcher today. Do it. Do it, people. Thousands, right? Wow. Yeah. After the show, I'm moved. I know. I'm yeah. very, very I'm passionate moved. about saving. I mean, yeah. who, 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 I am too. Who isn't? Yeah. I am too. Yeah. In this Se economy. Speaking of savings, Tommy and Nolan have a conversation. <laughs> they do. <Yeah. laughs> Transition. Transition. Good segue. That's a good segue, mm -hmm. man. Or as my friend says, Segui. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, Tommy is giving <laughs> Nolan the cold shoulder, another mm. middle schooler, high schooler mm -hmm. kind of deal. Uh, and, and not in the schoolyard by the flagpole. Mm. Nolan's like, Tommy, come on. on. Do you want to say it? Come on, Tommy. Come on. Come Tell me to my face. And Tommy's like, no, I'm only here because my CEO gave me an order. Mm. And Nolan is his, like, oh, the, the CEO that I'm banging? Hold on, let me just tease it out just a little bit longer. Mm. Um, Punch. Yeah, and then so he's like, listen, Berlin's a big girl. She can do what she wants, all right? You know, Tommy, I like you. You're a good kid. Pat, mm. right in the face. I'm mm. not a kid. And Nolan's like, all right, kid. You, start, you sure punch like one, but uh, yeah. let me give you some advice. You do that again, I'm going to have to hit you back. Mm. You don't want me to do that, mm -hmm. do you? He looked, he looked really bemused by that punch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he, he got punched in the face, and he looked mostly like it was like, oh, that's cute. Yeah, <laughs> but I think he was a little a little <laughs> in, impressed and pleased yeah. that Tommy actually had the balls to hit him. I think him. he yeah, did. They true. stood up yeah. for himself. Tommy did a great job uh, this episode of not being the guy who misses the people he's shooting at. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I would agree yeah. with that. Pottinger mm -hmm. was the, Pottinger took that role. He did. Yes. Yeah, uh, and you know, Tommy also he makes this weird point that is not really connectable yeah, to anything right. else. Um, Tommy's like, you know, this is the reason why Arissa doesn't uh, like doesn't is talk to you, you is avoiding you, yeah. mm -hmm. and he stalks away. And Nolan, I think, also part of the amusement is like. No, it's not. It's because mm -hmm. she's a weird machine lady. <laughs> yeah. uh, speaking of weird machine ladies, let's talk about Arissa. We got one scene with her this week. After the gathering of the machine zombies uh, in last episode, mm -hmm. uh, she basically she tells Nolan she's helping Sukar so that he doesn't worry about her. Mm -hmm. uh, meanwhile, there's this massive gathering, a pilgrimage right. yeah. of machine zombies. All these cars yeah, arriving. You see the rollers, they're all coming all in there. Rollers. And I was like, what's going on here? A yeah. couple Ford rolling. Cortinas, a gremlin or two. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of rollers out there. A lot of rollers. Yeah. So obviously we're building some kind of machine zombie army. It's pretty large. It's much yeah. larger than we possibly could have imagined. Yeah, it's huge. Because, like, as we said earlier in the season, like any virus, it's going to spread. It could be mm -hmm. just like swingers, though, you know, when they're all going and they're just one person in each roller. Hmm. Just going oh, to the same country. place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so it could be just 30 people. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was just going to say it's like Coachella. They're just going to a music festival. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Based, on the uh, based on the budget, it could be any number That's between right. 30 and, and 300. It depends okay. on how much they want to spend on that episode. Yeah. Okay, right. yeah. got That's it. true. Yeah. All right. We'll just have them be CGI bodies yeah, in the background. I was just background. gonna say that. Just throw in some it CGI. Could be, it could be thirty people, but it's just, the, or it could be three hundred people, but it's actually thirty people in different mm -hmm. costumes over and over <laughs> different and spots. over again. Yeah, mm. yeah, man. Mm -hmm. uh, so, yeah, we don't know what that's about. Mm -hmm. She says we didn't it, get anything from that it. Urzu wants this pilgrimage to happen, uh, and we're probably gonna find out more about it next week. I would guess. Mm. So. I would guess so. Yes. Um, so. Uh, 
Meanwhile, Pottinger and Yule be a plotting. Okay, uh, we discover um, that uh, Pottinger and Yule are responsible for Kenya being there. We don't know all the specifics yet, mm -mm. but basically, Pottinger sprung Yule from prison from Camp Reverie in order to create this Kenya clone for some nefarious reason. The nefarious reason being so that he can save the day. Mm -hmm. um, like an idiot. Mm -hmm. and, a goddamn nerd. Uh, and he basically is like, look, you need to kill her. You need to do whatever you gotta do. Get rid of the evidence. Mm -hmm. Let's let's get this into overdrive, okay? Let's get these let's get these panties like just super wet right now. I don't wanna wait for my life to be over I and I also wait. Don't want oh, to I wind up back in the front. Over. Yeah. Just, just Pottinger <laughs> standing in a canoe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, shirtless with flowers <laughs> and a bow tie. But <laughs> never mind the fact that he, she actually kissed him this episode, by the way. Amanda. Yeah. She I mean, it, yeah. Wasn't, she, it wasn't super passionate, right, it wasn't but like it was like, I romantic. like you kind of right. thing. Yeah. Well, we saw no, last he, time. he kissed her on the head, wasn't it? No. No. She, she kissed, kissed him on the cheek. Yeah, oh, on the cheek. cheek. Yeah. Of, like, it wasn't There's romantic, but it was thing, like a. But it was intimate. It was intimate. Yeah. Right. It was like, it was an, there was like a little a linger. It was, it was like, like a, I approve of you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But there's still something there. There was like a little linger on that cheek. Mm -hmm. There was a little cheek linger. Yeah, there was. Yeah. Well, which linger. is why he's so desperate to maintain this connection. Yeah. Uh, so he's willing to, to have Kenya offed and. Uh, and Yule offers to fry her memory mm -hmm. uh, using a combination of chemicals and microchip goggles. Mm -hmm. Basically, Oculus Rift with a, mm -hmm. with a circuit board on the outside. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, she comes to Kenya and Amanda, basically saying, "Look, I can help. Uh, I can help you regain your memories. Hooray!" Mm -hmm. Wee. Um, and instead. Uh, she puts the goggles on her and starts preparing this chemical when all of a sudden Kenya starts getting a memory back, a very vivid memory yeah. of being in a tube filled with water. Yeah. And someone's coming up to her wearing a bio suit and Yule's like, oh snap. Mm -hmm. And she starts pouring all this liquid and she's pushing it all through the tubes. Pretty sure it was just vanilla pudding. I know, I thought it was milk. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, uh, let's just be real. Milk in your bloodstream could probably kill you. Yeah. It's actually almost the exact same thing. Milk and blood. Really? Yeah. They're they're very similar. You want to do a science corner yeah, I think real we quick? Should. I mean, it, I we, don't we know the specific text. science facts, but Which I know most that scientists don't know when they talk about. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah. Here, let let this amateur <laughs> talk about. Uh, <laughs> uh, no, I'm. I, I remember reading something about milk and blood being almost the exact same thing. Oh, okay. And that when you really? when you are squeezing milk out, the process is basically you are squeezing blood out that goes through a filter of some oh. sort. Goes through a filter. Yeah. So okay. milk is essentially blood. Without blood, without so blood cells. Vampires. That's what you're I, saying. I, yeah, yes. we're all some sort of vamp, like a vampire. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. okay, I get it. This right. is why there's so much protein. Like yeah. a vampire. Yeah. Oh. Um, touch <laughs> for the very first time. No. Okay. <laughs> okay. No. No. We Come keep, on, we... Treasure Doll. What's your first time? <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's me, Treasure, Treasure Doll, doll. <laughs> playing the songs, songs that Mama won't, won't let you hear. Um... You chose that as your soundbite, Treasure Doll? Uh, oh, 100 percent. Because she's just shoving it in her face. Yep. Um, and uh, just as just as the poison is about to enter Kenya's bloodstream, she pulls off the goggles and pulls out all the stuff because she kind of sees an indigene. She's mm -hmm. not entirely sure, but it's obviously Doc Yule. Yeah, mm -hmm. real Doc Yule. Real, real Doc Yule. Yeah. Um. So, she go. Uh, so Kenya goes back up to the bedroom with Noel, and she's like, oh, "This place." so different now mm -hmm. there's color in it and books mm -hmm. and all these things that i wouldn't like when i was alive and uh and no one keeps kind of grilling her like hey so uh, do you remember the first time amanda caught us and she's like yeah that duct tape mm -hmm. oh man you know nearly ripped off my nipple he's like Haha, good times mm -hmm. Uh, and he's like, well, do you remember any of these other times? And she's like, bondage tape she's like, no, there are holes in my memory. Uh, and uh, <laughs> thanks for that clarification. Yes. <laughs> there are holes in her memory. Yes. Okay. Uh, and he, he's like, huh, I'm starting to notice a pattern. She's like, no time for patterns. Let's make some new memories. Yes, forget about the past. Yeah. And he's like, well, okay, well, but uh, oh, and we didn't even talk about the uh, very mature. Scene where he's like, "Listen, so do you remember yeah. we were in a thing together?" She's mm -hmm. like, "Yes," and she's he's like, "Do you remember breaking up?" She's like, "No." He's like, "Well, you won't remember this, but while you were gone, I've been sleeping with your sister." She's like, "Thank you, thank you, mm -hmm. thank, thank you. you for telling me." Mm -hmm. yeah. 
and everyone was mature. Mm-hmm. And they were. It was very mature. It's they like a big fight with the sister. Well, that's the thing. It's like Fighting how the they man. treat romance and sex in the future in this future mm-hmm. is probably the best element of this future mm-hmm. it's very progressive and very it sex is. positive there's yes, very little is. shame involved yeah. mm-hmm. uh, except, except for, for like, Tommy and well and Ponder a little bit and Castathans and Cast- well, Castathans oh, yeah. are still yeah you kind of yeah. see like they have that throwback kind of yeah, very conservative. Conservative, re- it's religious. It's a sex positive world out there. It is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then this one one thing they've had since the very beginning of this yeah. the, the show. Yeah. And um, Tommy's only upset because like Nolan effectively, you know, immediately slept with his ex. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Immediately. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Almost at the exact same time as she is breaking up with him. Like like yeah. literally she was breaking up with him here, okay? <laughs> and then she walked 3 feet and then slept with him here. Right there. But yeah. but the other thing I was wondering too is that if, if Kenya, as Kenya here, mm-hmm. didn't feel the same emotional thing because all she remembered were Amanda's mem- like so oh, I was like oh, she can have that same interesting Amanda. attachment with Nolan in yeah. that same way so it may not have bothered her in the same way you know like if you don't have a vested interest in that and and can't remember a lot of that stuff that's and interesting that relationship. Yeah. but then also I mean if you have Amanda's memories Amanda was always attracted to Nolan right. So I'm very curious know, about so where that like lies. Where the line That's is there. Yeah, yeah, that is a very interesting point. Mm. How do you um, remember something as someone outside yourself? Mm-hmm. Creepy. Whoa, well, well, guys, write a book. <laughs> send it to me. Yeah. You can send Jesse your books at <laughs> Care just of. one on, on Twitter. <laughs> on Twitter, uh, yeah. yeah. send your send e- self- e-books. <laughs> send me a book, please. Envelope, too. <laughs> to just uh, one. Write a book on the back of a $100 bill, and you can send it to me <laughs> at P.O. Box. Oh, just some number. <laughs> <laughs> I We're really all like someone to send uh, a piece of mail addressed to P.O. Box. Oh, just, just some, some number. Oh, just, <laughs> some, oh. Well, yeah. uh, we, just we, some. Oh, well, we 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 also skipped over a really interesting scene between uh, Stama and uh, Amanda after Stama and Daytac uh, dig up uh, the real Kenya's mm-hmm. uh, very yeah. Let's get into this very dead skull, uh, shrunken yes. like skull, a, like head. a really tiny little human mm-hmm. skull. Uh, and it's uh, it was super dead. Like yeah. there wasn't anything alive about it. It no. was, it was like um, how dead was it? Well, like you know, like how like when you and I are like living, yeah, and like we're we're like oh blood and Not like, breathing God. and oxygen, alive. Uh. And, like, it, uh, yeah, all that kind of stuff. Like the opposite of that. Very dead. Yeah, mm-hmm. so dead. Uh, so <laughs> they're then, up to uh, their ass and death stink. Yeah, yeah uh, they're exactly. up to their death ass stink. and death stink. Yeah. That's the alternate title of this yeah. episode. Mm-hmm. Uh, and. Uh, Stama confronts Amanda to try and kind of warn her. Yeah, she's like, listen, she's an imposter. I know this is going to be very hard to hear, but your sister is dead. And she, like, makes this... She makes this lie that's very plausible. It's like, I have all these contacts. Multiple sources. Multiple sources have told me she is dead. I'm sorry, but she is. And Amanda is just like... Yes. Gotta have at least two. Yeah. She friends her. She's like, you say this lie to anyone else, I will will hurt you. Mm -hmm. And it will be painful and it and won't it be w- quick and it will last yeah mm. yeah. yeah we all we all liked it mm-hmm. she's she was very upset but it, it was an interesting turn for stomach because you could see how much it hurt her mm-hmm. yeah to... well she had this very personal moment with the skull yeah where she was she just like holding her one last time and she didn't she didn't want to leave it and uh and it and uh, as we see later she makes a she makes a headstone mm-hmm. for yeah. uh, Kenya which I thought was really interesting too. Yeah, and she was out very there sweet. and yeah. it was again at seeing this 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 other side a to her again. Heart. Yeah, the yeah. softer Yeah. The softer side to her. So the headstone also looked like it was made out of candy. <laughs> <laughs> like spree. Like, like sprees. It, did. Mm, yeah. it was made out of multiple yeah. sprees. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Um what else do we have to talk about? So yeah, so Kenya tries to to sleep with Nolan and he's like, Whoa, no whoa, 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 hold the phone. Where are all the scars from your ex-husband? Mm-hmm. I am only attracted to women with scars from their right. ex-husband. I like That's an embellishment. Be, yes. That's not That's what he it. said. Yeah. It's like, I like another um, baggage. But he realized what was up. Not mm-hmm. us. And he made the very smart decision of saying, just uh, hold on. I'll be right back. Stay here. Because that always works. Which, of course, works. always it works. It always works. Yeah. Yeah. always works. Yeah. If you tell someone who's going through an emotional trauma to stay there, mm-hmm. they'll just stay they there. Yeah. yeah. Instead of taking their sister's gun and going mm-hmm. after the doctor who, uh, you know, brought them back to life. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And uh, Yule confesses to everything and is like, look, you know, you were an indigene that, uh, that we stole from Camp Reverie and we forced you against your will to become 
uh, Kenya Rosewater. The DNA was everywhere, so that was easy, but we needed the, the memories. <laughs> the DNA was mm-hmm. everywhere. Everywhere. <laughs> Just on every, on every yeah, surface. Everything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Everywhere. Yeah. Uh, so they needed the memories, and that's why Pottinger went so far as to get the ego mm-hmm. and to I think even getting her addicted to drugs was to get her distracted enough to even use the ego yeah which means like uh, this is a yeah. multi-step plan it was because now wow. thinking back to it like yeah. remember when she was I, I know she was hallucinating but was when when he was in the room there was he really in the room and sh- and he went in to get DNA of of Kenya like when yeah. she was having that freak out moment thinking someone came into her and broke into her place yeah mm. uh, yeah that, that was that really him be, and, and he was yeah. going to get the DNA and all that yeah way mm-hmm. back at the beginning so this of the is season. a multi-layered terrible plan mm-hmm. multi-layered terrible yes. he had plan. so many chances to realize <laughs> this is a bad idea I, you know I and could just ask her him. out like yeah. she's like falling for right. me on her own I wonder if I could just I could just say to her like hey you wanna get I coffee? got an idea Ooh. I'm gonna go to the flower shop oh no oh. no this and is a bad idea I'm right. gonna and I'm gonna set up a bomb oh, no, <laughs> right? no 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 I'm going off the track wait no 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 finish your thought wait wait okay maybe this bomb maybe maybe it's like I'm gonna set up a bomb Right, and Bump and glitter. I'm gonna I'm gonna call over everybody to come over okay. except for Amanda. Uh, well, okay, okay, and then She's I'm gonna the set gonna the bomb. To, I'm gonna set the bomb off. Yeah. Okay, but then I'm going to kill everybody. I'm gonna oh, replace okay. them with Indogenes. Okay. And I'm going to give them messages to tell them everybody how cool I really am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and also, okay. it'll be raining mm-hmm. flowers. It'll be raining flowers from the mm-hmm. bomb yeah. Yeah. Okay. going on at that time. And and it'll he, be so romantic. It'll be so romantic. Uh, it'll be the most so romantic sweet. thing. I've got advice for anyone who has a crush on anyone out there. Yeah. Uh, if your plan to get the, uh, the object of your admiration to, uh, to pay attention to you, if it starts with, uh, I've got this great scheme. <laughs> uh, you're going about it the wrong way. Just right. stop right there. The you words, need the word re-evaluate. scheme should not come well, in. Well, you should follow that with a little laugh. Yeah. yeah. Or at the very least, a mm-hmm. Dr. Evil pinky. Yeah, just pet your, <laughs> yes. pet your bald cat. Yes. And, and your beforehand, if you use the word, oh, so it's a little scheme. Oh, you a little scheme. All right, all right. Um, so uh, mm. she's about to shoot Yule for what she did. Pottinger comes in and is like, ha, 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 I've got my my Nazi stormtrooper gun. He's got a Luger. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, and just like, I've got you both right where I want you. you. Uh, and then Kenya's like, no, you don't. She pushes him, and then she runs away, mm-hmm. and Yule runs away, and he misses both shots. Mm-hmm. And he's like, darn. <laughs> Damn kids. Kenya goes to clean out the safe, and Amanda's like, you're here, because this is what I would do, <laughs> steal all the money. Yeah. Huh? Um, and, uh, and Kenya's like, you can't stop me. I'm not your sister. Doesn't tell her about Pottinger. No. Why not? That's why, the, don't you no te- why wouldn't you? Exactly. Why don't you tell her about Pottinger? And why doesn't Pottinger, like, I don't see why Pottinger would arrive thinking that Amanda didn't know about. Something. Yeah, like. That the gig is like, up. I yeah, would, yeah. if I was Pottinger, I would have just left town immediately. Mm-hmm. Like, back been, to like, Dakota and been, been like, done with it. I would have been like, gig's up. She went to Amanda. She went to. A uh, Yule went to Amanda. Someone It'd went like to Amanda. It'd be like the first thing you would think they would yeah. do. Yeah. Like, they got away. Except Ponder walks in the room and is like, everyone cool? Yeah. Great. <laughs> he Good. walked in <laughs> the joint. <laughs> every and song. Every song we will sing them. Yeah. Uh, and uh, so he's like, yeah, it's really, really quite sad, you know. Um, yeah. uh, Doc Yu was responsible for the whole thing, you know. Uh, is, peace wait, and love. Ringo? Hello, Ringo. Hello, Ringo. <laughs> yeah. It's not that we're better, it's just that we're more popular. We're just more popular. popular I play know. the drums. Yeah. yeah. I play the drums. <laughs> Octopus's Garden. Octopus's yeah. Garden. You remember that? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, the other important thing to Good mention show. so, um, <laughs> Doc Yu goes to, to Daytac for help. And uh, he's like, I remember a certain someone who wouldn't help me move a certain eyeless body a few weeks ago. Why should I help you? She's like, you're my only friend. Snap. And I was waiting for him to be like, I also remember a hand job that <laughs> I wanted right. and you wouldn't give me. You, you wait, me. did he say that or did you say that? <laughs> I said at, it. You said I that. I mm-hmm. said it okay. because that's still that's exactly. one of the most shocking She, she bowed out the, of an old fashion. She did. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like in any case, yeah. the other big deal this episode, the other big news 
is that uh, uh, Rave's son Quentin yes, returns, Quentin returns. from his journey to find his mom. And he's mm. aged. And he's aged. He looks like an actor. Yes. He's dressing. He's an all grown up actor now. He went to acting school between he seasons. Did. Yeah, he went, yes. to, he went to acting school and his he's mom, got a great haircut. His yes. mom totally is Stella want. Adler. Yes. <laughs> uh, and he confronts his dad angrily about, you know, like he should have just shot his mom. Yes, like yeah. she was treated Terrible. so poorly by the Botanist Collective. Mm. But then, shocker of the century, mm. after uh, Yule has made her new home down in old uh, St. Louis mm. underground, is that mm -hmm. Brian Goggleman mm -hmm. is in mm -hmm. fact Quentin, Quentin Macaulay. Yeah. And he's working with the Votanist mm -hmm. Collective to take down the Earth Republic. How Tur interesting is it that the uh, the VC soldier that we couldn't yeah. see mm -hmm. was a human who right. had an alien, Botan, as a captive that looks like a human. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. How, how weird it's is really that? It's really weird like, and complex. Yeah, it is. So, it, so weird that Goggleman was a made-up name. Yeah. Yes. So, so odd. odd. So no odd. Goggleman? Yeah, no. there aren't any Goggleman. But, you think they're the ones who made the yeah. Hala. I think, uh, yeah. I think it's time <laughs> for us to talk predictions. Predictions? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And now, you're after Buzz TV. Predictions. <laughs> All right, I'm going to throw this out there oh, right Remember, spoilers, away. everyone. Spoilers. Yeah. 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 Um, I'm going to throw this out there right away. I'm saying that uh, that Quentin's mother, Pilar, is mm. our big bad for the season. Ooh. Ooh. And that she has been corrupted by the VC, or she is now leading the VC, or something like that, and she has brought Quentin over to the cause. She has brainwashed him, or he just... It has been guilted into helping her, perhaps. Mm, okay. But she's definitely lurking in the wings mm -hmm. with these VC yeah. folks. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. I think she is a part of it. Yeah. For sure. I think she's got to be, right? Yeah. yeah. I like that idea. Although I will, I will add to that that I will say that she is not the big bad. Ooh. But that the Voltanis is actually also trying to uh, keep everything under wraps and protect uh, defiance and everything from the Kazuri, from, from the whole techno from the techno zombie. Zombies. Yes. yes, and that, that it seems like she might be the big bad, but they're really actually trying to do something good as opposed to the Earth Republic who wants it, to use the weaponry mm -hmm. for their own own evil purposes. It's also possible that Quentin was dressed as a Votanist Collective uh, to make them look bad. Like, that hmm. was his thing. He was to going discredit to, them. Yeah, to discredit them. And there and was make no it, bomb there was plot. No. And there wasn't a mm. bomb plot. And there was nothing else. Like, it was him trying to make them uh, feel, like, make the threat more imminent to Defiance. Interesting theory. Yeah. Yeah. yeah see that too. I'm still so angry though about the whole this whole scheme that we've had going on for yeah, all these episodes. Yeah, and I'm like thinking there was pay off well. It was not a good payoff. I was hoping there was something more yeah. mm, beyond that. Um, yeah. And that's kind of disappointing. Yeah. So uh, at least we have this do. pilgrimage to look forward to. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, do you think they're heading down to get the Kaziri in the next couple episodes? I would think so because I, I feel like so. you need to go back to that. We, we yeah. talked about it last week. Yeah. You do have to go back there. Yeah, I think that's and how what the arc rises. They're gonna try and how interesting that Yule just happens to be right down there. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So the I feel like we're setting it up. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hiding away from everybody. Yeah. Nobody will ever find me That's here. Right. It's the safest I'll be place down in my lair yeah. in the ground. No, no one to check in and see if I'm doing crazy science experiments. <laughs> that <too. Yeah. laughs> it's the truth. She, um, she's gonna have a new bio man ready by the time they right. get down there. Mm. Love me a good bio man. Oh, yeah. 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 What a bio Who man. Doesn't? What a bio man. What a bio man. 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 <laughs> anyway, uh, folks. So All next week, science. Sci-Fi is airing two yeah, back, back to back, to back episodes of Defiance. In a row. Two. Yeah. Back we're to still back. we're still figuring out exactly how we're going to be handling uh, taping both of these podcasts. Uh, just because you know, if you if you didn't know, we hear it after Buzz. We're so crazy busy. We've got so many shows going yeah, on. That's right. It is uh, difficult to add an extra hour uh, in the day. But we stay we tuned. Stay tuned to right. our twitters because uh, as soon as we know what's going on, we will tweet about it so that you are the first to know. Uh, we'll hopefully have both episodes for you next week. In fact, right. that is a priority for we'll us. We'll do them immediately. So everyone knows too that there's two back-to-back -back episodes. Yeah, yeah. make sure so you're watching both. Sure it's DVR not a rerun. Yeah. DVR, if you have your season pass, make sure. It's yeah, working. It's, All right. Uh, yeah. Both new. So All we'll right, see folks. how it goes. Four episodes left in the season now, I too. Know. That's it. So we're getting through half next week. Yeah, we're getting yeah. getting down to the wire. Mm -hmm. uh, Jesse Klein, where can the people find you? Yeah, you can find me on Twitter and Instagram at JessKlein1. 
Okay, there and Scott go. Moore. And you can find me on the old Twitter at sman80. That's S M A N eight zero. And here on Sunday nights for the final season of True Blood. And Nando. You can find me right here on Afterbuzz uh, for Falling Skies and other shows in the fall. And on Twitter and Instagram at Nando Vell. N A N D O V E L. Okay, and you can find me on Twitter at Matt Lieberman. That's M A T T L I E B E R M A N. You can also find all my videos for SourceFed and SourceFed Nerd on YouTube. I also did a couple of videos this week. I was guest hosting on DNews, Anywho, Rev3 Games, and uh, and TestTube. Uh, so you can check all that stuff out. It's probably liked on my YouTube page. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. We will be back next week with two all-new episodes. Mm -hmm. See you then. From After executive Buzz. producers Maria Menunos, Kevin Undergaro, Phil Svitek, and the entire AfterBuzz TV staff, we would like to thank you for listening to the AfterBuzz TV network. To watch or listen to other after shows and post comments or questions, be sure to visit AfterBuzzTV.com. I'm Sir Richard Wentworth, and this has been a presentation of AfterBuzz TV. Buzz, you later. The views expressed herein are those of the hosts only and do not necessarily reflect the views of AfterBuzz TV or its owners or principals. Thank you for watching AfterBuzz TV on YouTube. For more of your favorite after shows and interviews, subscribe to our channel here and be sure to share your opinion on the episode in the comment section below here. We'd love to see what you guys are buzzing about. Thanks again. Buzz you later.